Andy, welcome to Lauren Football Club. You've put pen to paper on a, a contract after being here for a few weeks. Tell us about how the move came about. Um, I was free agent after I came back from England there. And, um, you know, Conor Marlon, I had, I know, he uh, just dropped his chair in the message so and gave me in just have a look at me. And obviously, came in for a few days and, you know, impressed Tiernan and Seamus. Thankfully, they took the hit on me and looked like it was a good one. Yeah. And you were at Accrington Stanley in England yeah. for, for the last two years and a couple of loans. Um, how, how did you find things there? Yeah, I loved it. I loved that full time aspect. That's one of the reasons why I thought Lauren would be perfect for me too, to stay in that full time. But yeah, you know, I, I love being over there and well, just where I want to go back again, hopefully. I do well here. Yeah, you were uh, with Dirkview when you were younger and, and yeah. Maiden City as well, and obviously caught the eye and, and got the move. So um, you've, you've enjoyed your football so far? Yeah. No, I started off therapy when I was you know, just since I started playing football and moved on to main city then for a few years and obviously done well there and got my chance across the water. It just didn't work out then but you know, it was my best way to go again. And for those maybe who don't know, tell us a wee bit about yourself as a player, kind of where you, you enjoy playing and the type of player you are. Um, I, I could play in each, each uh, wing or behind a striker. You know, I like to get on the ball, you know, be as effective as possible, get off players, get beyond players make things happen, as many goals as I can, assists, you know, yeah. Uh, and how, how have you enjoyed being here? You've uh, been sort of in and among the players for, for a couple of weeks on and off, so yeah. how, how have you found things being here so far? No, I've loved every minute I've been in, that's why I just wanted to get it done as soon as I could. But no, I've been in for a few weeks there and the sessions, you know, it's, everything's you know, very professional. You know, you get your gym, you get your food, you know, I think it's just perfect. Uh, and how, how do you find things in terms of coming from England in that environment back to uh, fitting in in every park? Are there kind of similarities there in terms of that full-time environment? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You know, I want to get back into a full-time. You know, I had other places I could go, but they weren't full-time. And I'm just thinking this is the best platform for me to you know, get going again. You know, it's very professional. I'm pleasantly surprised how professional it was. And it was a no-brainer really for me to you know, sign here. And as a 20-year-old, you, you want to be involved in as much senior football as possible and sort of start to, to make your mark? Yeah, that was the plan. That's what I sort of missed you know, when I was in England. You know, I played uh, two long spells, you know, men's football, but I want to get back into something now, full, full-time men's football. I think it's the best hopefully if I perform this year, I get on the pitch as soon as possible. Uh, and we have a, a date to aim towards in terms of competitive football and hopefully some training games before then. So like everybody else, you just want to be out in the grass now uh, and playing football? Itching. I'm going to get back out. It's been too long. Super. Thanks very much, Andrew. Yeah.